one thing I like to do when I'm out is I keep my herb bag with me. And the location that I'm in right now is prime for mullein. Mullein is an herb. It can be used for many things, making teas. Um, Native Americans called it big tobacco. They smoked it for a pipe for their lung. And you can see here, I'm gonna lose it all. Here's a piece of dried mullein, and I'll show you the plant here in just a second. But, you know, when I'm out, I'm doing scout hikes, I'm trapping, I'm canoeing, whatever it is that I need, I may run across, such as herbs. I always want my herb bag with me. Keep my possible, such as my money, license, hunting license, and all that stuff in there. Kind of separate it. This is a, this is buffalo hide. It was made for me. Uh, I picked it up from a 90, she was 93 year old uh, Cree and Cherokee. Creek and Cherokee Indian. Uh, she made this. And she made the medicine bag and the pouch that's inside of it. But I like to have it with me when I'm out uh, and I'm going to the woods because I never know what I'm going to come across. And uh, one of the things is lemon tree. Here we found a wild lemon tree, which is really great for making tonics, making teas, making uh, medicine. Um, it's a really fine tree to come across in the wild. Something that I don't have around where I'm at too much. I have to go several miles to get it, so I take advantage of that while I'm out. And uh, here, mullein is prevalent. We also have a lot of prickly pear in this area. This was a lot of Native American areas. Uh, Native American people lived in this area. There's uh, found arrowheads out here messing around. So it's a really prevalent for uh, wild edibles and such. And, uh, you know, I try to take advantage of that while I'm out. So I always try to stay prepared for that.